Well, what a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week and the fans are pouring into the stadium. The tension palpable. Stay with us. We'll have all the action for you live right here on EA TV. And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player, Stuart Robson. And a really pivotal match to bring you. We're at the quarter-final stage of the 2023 Women's World Cup. It's Spain versus the Netherlands. Well, this has the makings of a very good game. Two sides full of quality, a great atmosphere and everything to play for. A last four places up for grabs here. Here's the lineup for Spain. Well, the wingers will be key here. They have to choose the right time to give width and the right time to come infield to support the centre forward. If they can do that, they're a potent front three. No doubt about that. And foul it is then. And the referee spotted the foul but has played advantage. Albaredondo. Running with the ball confidently. Oh, denied by the keeper. Well, what more can you say? That's goalkeeping at its very best. Stoppage in play and a chance for the referee to go back and retrospectively hand out a yellow card. And there's the delivery. Abeyera and Paredes. Good work from the Netherlands to win back possession. Botellas. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Van der Donk. Well, showing everyone her abilities in possession. Oh, this is looking promising. Badenstein! And fine goalkeeping. Well, credit to her for that piece of ball winning. Well, the outcome is a free kick here. Well, just a rebuke rather than a caution, Stuart. Well, it's not a bad tackle, and the referee's got that right. Well, that goes down as a very disappointing free kick, and I suspect she knows it. Yeah, dear, oh dear, oh dear. That's a real waste of a good opportunity from a free kick position. Not sure she's going to be too happy with that. Badier. Aitana Bonmati. On to Puteas. And Spain unable to hold on to the ball. Can they hit on the break? Well, it was a foul, but good use of advantage by the referee. Firing it towards goal. Superb block. Well, there it is. The Dutch have had a lot of the ball in the last 15 minutes, and they're playing really well and creating chances. But surely only a matter of time before they take the lead here.
space on the flank. Well, that is how to nullify the opposition. Now, options are plenty. Chance to take the lead. In it goes! The goal for 1-0, and that changes the dynamic. Well, here it is again, and I have to say, the defending is so poor. They make so many bad decisions there. No wonder the keeper's exposed. Well, back underway, and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. Tere Abeyera. Now, who can she pass it to? Is it going to be? And another one! Two quick goals! Will it turn out to be the two punch knockout? Well, here's the replay, and just look at that power. That's almost unstoppable. That's a great strike. So the ball rolling again at 2 0. And the timing was perfect. Ball one. Botellas. Aitana Bonmati. Victoria Pelova. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. Under some pressure. Tere Abeyera. Ona Batye. Now with Hermoso. And one minute of stoppage time has been added on. Well, credit to her, because that was just a whisker away. Well, she surprised everybody, including me. A decent effort, you have to say. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. Well, they've got things going again here, and I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Plenty of support here. It's looking promising. Could be! Precision and style, superbly done. Well, just look at this again. Great technique, perfect contact and a brilliant finish. Top stuff. again in what has been an utterly one-sided match there to win it back plenty of support here as a go oh good save
Over it comes. It comes to nothing in the end. Prepare to take on the shot. Pretty routine there for the goalkeeper. Really doing a fine job of protecting the ball. Well, sadly, they just couldn't keep possession. This looks promising out wide. Well, let's see about the cross. Terrific block. And a very good challenge. Oh, her volley was close. High degree of difficulty. Well, it's a fantastic effort. Difficult technique, but she's caught it well. Very unfortunate. And they're making a change. This has been a top-class display today. Just look how many chances they've created. And if they want to, they could score a hatful of goals here. Badier. Well-timed tackle. Irene Paredes. Alba Redondo. And it's played into the centre. And still dangerous. And in the end, no damage done. Now, who can she play it to? A gift for any goalkeeper. Jackie Hronen. Spits it. Went in strongly to win the ball. Well, the supporters think it's on. Well, it wasn't a simple save to make. Time for a change then. Now sending it in. Well, it has come to nothing. And getting the better of a marker. Good looking cross. Pressing high to win the ball. Botellas. Well, that's not watertight defending. But it wasn't a straightforward save, but credit to her. Well, opting for the short corner. Shot attempted. Determined defending. And the cross goes in. Well, pretty straightforward for the keeper, you've got to say. Five minutes left. And possession lost, intercepted. Running with the ball confidently. Has a go! Well, doesn't have to do it on her own. And the cross comes to nothing. And we are going to have two additional minutes. Theme emerging of wasted possession. The whistle is sounded and a place for Spain confirmed in the last four. Yeah, it doesn't come much easier than that, does it? I thought they played well and it was an excellent overall performance, particularly going forward. They'll certainly be confident going into the next round.